Looks like someone's in dire need of coffee. Hell yeah! Here you are. Thanks. This gonna hit the spot. You know, you're not like those other suits, Miss McPherson. You're okay in my book. What do we have? The usual? Yeah, the same old shit. Anonymous phone call, no witnesses, and another dead girl. This one more banged up than the others. When I got here, I figured it was your perp's work, so I didn't bother reporting it to everyone. I, I just called Miller. Besides you, who got here first? Miller did, about ten minutes ago. Claire followed a few minutes later. Where's the crime scene? The crime scene is through the entrance, up the stairs and to your right. Miller be the chicken shit leaning up against the fridge. Miss McPherson, be careful in there. I need a tetanus shot just looking at this place. So, are you the human popsicle yet? Can you believe this fucking weather? I mean, shit! It was 60 yesterday! And can you believe all this goddamn snow, too? Look at this shit! You know how hard it was getting here? Miller got here first, huh? Did he do it again? Yeah, he did. <laughs> oh, Claire is pissed as hell, too. She threw him out into the hallway. Well, okay. I guess I'll head up and see how Miller's doing. Okay, Agent McPherson. You watch yourself in there. Wow, you remind me of when I was at the Academy. One day I decided to run the obstacle course after lunch. I lost everything, even my breakfast. It was a gruesome mash of pizza and French toast. If you're trying to help me, it's not working. Here you are. It might make things pass more... smoothly? Then again, maybe not. Miller, you're going to have to stop trying. You and dead bodies don't mix. I suggest you wait for us next time. We can't risk any more donut-contaminated crime scenes. Yes, I will, Agent McPherson. So what can you tell me? It's our guy's work, all right. The victim's in an old bathtub. She's stuck in ice. I couldn't see much. Thank God. So where's Claire? Old Indian saying, follow stench. Find little pale-faced fat woman. Christ, Miller. I'm really not in the mood. Sorry. She's in the bathroom. Follow the hallway to the end, and it's the door to your left. She's working near the body. I think she needs you to take a look at the rest of the apartment. Here, take the camera. Claire doesn't want me around, so you're gonna have to take pictures, too. Wonderful. Oh, by the way, stop with the Agent McPherson, please. Just plain Victoria is fine, all right? Will do, Victoria. Just out of morbid curiosity, where did the Martians land this time? I hurled in the toilet. Can we change the subject? Jeez, that would bring you to 2 and 0. Oh. Claire must be very happy right now. Actually, no she isn't. I think she wants to kill me. She threatened to tie me to your 4x4 and drag me through the streets. Take it easy. See you in a bit. You have some splaining to do. Hello, Clarice. So, what's all the fuss about? Let's see. I have an idiot who throws up at a crime scene. I'm understaffed because I'm the only one crazy enough to work during the holidays. I'm freezing my butt off, the body is stuck in ice, and what else? This might actually help. Coffee? Yes, please. It's no wonder you were my best student. What can I do to help? Have a look around and gather any evidence that you can find. 
I've wasted enough time getting this body ready for the meat wagon. You know how they can get pissy. Anyway, I thought I saw some blood stains as I came in. You can start by collecting some of that and then look around for more. Remember, always take a picture before you collect something. To help you out, grab the forensic tools from my briefcase in what's left of the kitchen. Once you've collected the evidence, come and help me out in here. You do know I'm a field agent, right? I think this is a little out of my league. Vic McPherson is out of her league? This is a first? Where did that come from? I don't know. I think I need a vacation. Sweetie, you can't always catch them on the first three victims. I know, I know. Hey, maybe you should take it easy with Miller. Take it easy? This is the second time I have to go through his vomit to see if there's any evidence hidden in the pile. Take it easy? No, I don't think so. Thanks for helping out. My pleasure, Clarice. I'll stop that. Nice Christmas decorations. Bingo, we've got hair and fiber samples. Getting a sample by dipping my finger in it. I need a tool. properly. Graffiti looks great with the black light on. Getting a sample by dipping my finger in it. I need a tool. 
I need a tool before I can use this properly. I'm done. Good. Go put what you collected in my briefcase and come back here. I still need your help. Okay, all done and neatly packed. Great. Thanks a lot, sweetie. So, what's next? I need some shots of the body before we move things around and disrupt the original crime scene. Okay. So what can you tell me so far? Not much right now. Probably like the other four. Cause of death is drowning, but I'll make it official after the autopsy. She was stabbed numerous times and she was eviscerated. Nothing indicates a struggle or resistance on the part of the victim. My guess is she was unconscious during the stage of the assault. Can you walk me through what happened here? Not now. I'd rather do preliminary lab work first and also analyze the evidence you picked up. I'll give you a briefing when I finish a few tests. Okay. I think you can remove the cloth from her face now. Aw, oh, you spoil me. <laughs> Look at the tattoo work on her skin. This girl like pain. I have a feeling she's a pro. I don't know why. Just call it a hunch. Which would be a first according to the killer's MO and profile. I'll run the victim's name through the database to see if we hit something. What's her name? According to the ID in her purse, it's Cynthia Woods. Now can you take her picture without the rag on her face? Do you still need me here? Not really. I just enjoy the company. But I can see you'd rather be somewhere else. Listen, I can handle things here on my own till the boys get here. Anyhow, you look tired as hell. Oh, thanks for letting me off the hook. But seriously, if you need me, I'll stay. It's fine, sweetie, really. You're not completely off the hook. I'll see you back at the morgue for my briefing. I wouldn't miss it for the world. See you soon. Go, Miller. Okay, where to? The office. What? 
Absolutely love what they've done here. The view is just super. Good idea. All I need now is something to pry these boards off. <laughs> Looks like I'm gonna have to do this the hard way. Are you okay? <laughs> Do you think he's okay? Yeah. <laughs> he's fine. Do you think he's okay? Yeah. <laughs> he's fine. 